Good afternoon, this is George Brooks from Next Horizon uh, here in Phoenix, Arizona, looking at this uh, aquaponic system that's going to be providing us about 400 pounds of food this year. Now, the first thing I'd like you to take a look at is that uh, you don't see any pipes. Uh, we avoided pipes. Uh, pipes cost money by themselves. Pipes cost energy because of friction and friction costs money, uh, energy costs money, electricity costs money. So because we are putting everything inside of this pool where all the water is at the same level, that means that we have a very low energy cost because we don't have to pump uphill. But because of that, it allows us to do some very interesting things with the system as you see. Now before we get to that, uh, we want to note that the bees have found us. The bees uh, has found that we are a source of water. The bees are getting kind of rare, regrettably. And that means they'll be coming here all summer for water and all summer for pollination, which is great for us. We'll have to work around them as far as harvesting, but when the bees go home in the evening, then we can come out and harvest. Now I'd like to show you one more little innovation that goes along with this system being all at one level and that is the solids removal and recirculation pump. This is the fish tank. This is a, um, a um, uh, food safe um, brute can. Um, high density pump, um, I th think it, it's HDDP, I think. Uh, high density polyethylene tank. But you see right here, that is a very small, very simple airlift pump. This simple airlift pump moves water at about three, ga three gallons a minute, which is enough with the 40 gallons of water that you see in there to circulate the water through this tank every uh, five times an hour, which is great to have more fish in there. Uh, we've done, we, we've had uh, about 20 pounds of fish in there at one time in the, few, in the past, which is about five, uh, uh, half a pound per uh, gallon of water and it worked, it worked out very well. And we also added a new kind of um, fail safe. So if the power goes off, we still have our fish safe. Now, uh, the, now the, the, the nice thing about this, because we are, again, not lifting up any distance, the air pump uses very little air, pumps about three gallons of water a minute over here into the clarifier. And in the clarifier, the water goes down into this clarifier, and then it comes back up through the bird netting, and it, it and the solids drop out. Now, um, the only way you can really know this thing is working is so quiet is that when you see bubbles on occasion rising out of this pipe. And so, uh, this is an, a very nice little innovation for us because the solid lift pump it sucks the water out. That, so that means that uh, unlike an SLO where you have to force the water out with head pressure, this right here sucks it out and it's far easier to pull something than to push something. And uh, that lowers the energy cost and makes the cleaning of this tank very, very effective. Water is pulled in from the outside through strategically placed holes and th that's how the system works. So with that, I'd like, you, I'd like to leave you with that for today and we'll see you on the next go round. Bye.